the strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, most it's people over. believe, yeah, his opponent is in a it's world over, of trouble. All right, here he is for my money. Mike, the most well-rounded fighter in this division, a true mixed martial artist at his core, and he believes he'll have a lot of advantages in this matchup. Tonight. Everyone talked about him being well-rounded. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that can do everything across the board at such a high level. Yeah, he's comfortable wherever the fight goes. Maybe he'll grapple tonight, maybe he'll strike. Makes him a hard guy to prepare for. Underway, and it'll be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Well, you saw the tail of the tape. He has a reach advantage and made good use of it there with that punch. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big ball punch lands. Now we get back to range. Oh, look at him land another jab there. He's certainly using that weapon effectively here tonight. The most effective weapon in all of boxing, in all of combat sports, is a jab. This young man has a knowledge of using it like no one else. Just misses with the jab there. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Diggy kick. Throws the right hand there. Just out of range with the big right hand. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing, Muscle. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Watch the shot. All right, so there he goes, continuing to land that jab. When they put this highlight together, it's just going to be one head snapping back. It's going to be boxers going back and watching this guy and going, wow, this is what a jab is supposed to look like. Big knee lands to the body. Can't take many of those. You better check. Real nice body kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, man, look at that. Picture perfect. Got the leg, got his position, got another beautiful kick out. All right, so he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. Reversal here, DC. What a way to switch the position. Fantastic movement by the bottom fighter. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Nice punch by George. What a beautiful kick. The Korean Superboy gets the single leg takedown. Nicely done there. Oh, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Man, isn't it fun to watch this dude work on the mat? He's unbelievable how fluid he is in his motions on the mat. All right, so he's sort of turtled up here. Not great body language. Perhaps he's trying to bait him in a little bit. Big punch man over the top. 
How's he gonna follow this one? Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. Oh, really exploiting his reach advantage as he landed the jab there, DC. Defense there, huge block for him. Beautiful punch. Oh, nice. Nice. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Big leg kick lands. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Big kick land. Oh! Huge right hand! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. And he's looking for that left hand just missed. Oh, big left! He blocked the punch. Oh, and he finally gets the takedown now. So what do they say? It, try, try again. If, if at first you don't succeed, you try, try again. And this guy is the poster boy for that saying, because he shot many takedown attempts, and he finally has secured one. Last round over, you took his best shots and smiled back at him. Now it's your turn. We have to go and move forward. We have to be aggressive. All right, so leg kicks on, leg kicks, the big storyline in that round. DC, take us through the replay, man. Yeah, he was, I mean, what a display of high-level striking. What a display of getting the leg to the target very, very quick. So quick that your opponent cannot react. Great job. You ready to fight? You ready? Go! Joy gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, nice job to land the knee to the body. Man, I wish I was that tall. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. You got to check these low leg kicks. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow up. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. How about that shin? Oh, lands an elbow. Didn't open him up, but very well could have. Look at him yank the head and land that beautiful punch from the clinch. I mean, is this thing on repeat? How many times can you say punch to the head? Back and forth we go. Straight right hand now, just misses. Wow, actually got the takedown. All oh, the ground and pound strikes continue to rain down. The opponent better move out of harm's way or the referee's gonna stop this. He better start to move, and when his opponent starts to posture, he needs to put his feet on the hip, push him away to try to escape this very, very dangerous position. All right, so you gotta be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't wanna mess around for too long. Close guard. Well, he's staying pretty effective here, fighting off of his back. Nice strike landed there by the bottom by Choi. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Great punch. 
big leg kick lands. Oh, that's a nice straight punch there. Threw the punch, got to the target. Loaded up on that right hand, too. Ooh! Oh, he landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach and certainly is making it count in this one. The Korean Superboy gets caught with that punch. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be, and if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Look at him whip his hip into that kitchen. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Beautiful strike. Oh, nice combination here on the feet. That'll set up the takedown. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Oh, wow, that happened quickly as the fighter reverses position there on the ground. Unbelievable position change. Wow, what a transition. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. All right, he's got the hooks in, DC, working off of his back. Now look for him to attack the neck of his opponent to try to get the rear choke. Might be a submission attempt here, Chad. I mean, you cannot sit in a full guard. When you sit in the full guard, you give these guys so many opportunities. Oh, nice job to get back up again. You don't want to hang out on the ground with this guy. Man, it looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Tags him with the left. And that's the end of round number two. All right, take a seat. Deep breath. Breathe. Take a drink. All right, here we go. Listen. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays from that last round. Unbelievable to see these high-level competitors get in each other's face, tuck their chin, bite down on the mouth guard, and just let it all hang out over the course of five minutes. Third round underway. So once again, making good use of his size as he lands the knee. Look at him chopping the woods. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. There's the kick, it's blocked. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Straight punch lands. Just misses with the straight right. Oh, nice. Oh, tagged him with the uppercut, DC. We'll see if he can follow it up now. He was so used to punches coming straight, he didn't see the hook. I'm sorry, he didn't see the uppercut coming from underneath. Just misses there with the left. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Oh, buckled him there. Beautiful shot to the body. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Oh, huge clock! Just out of range with that right hook. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the street. Take it for a ride. Nice double leg. Nice finish. Oh, 
Well, nice job using his strength there to posture up. We'll see what he can do now. He's going to start looking to land big shots yeah. in the top. Pretty good ground and pound by him here. He told us on Thursday he needed to be more effective in these situations. Certainly effective tonight. Many people have gone away from this style of fighting. This man has embraced it, and you are seeing why he's one of the best that we've seen do it in a long time. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Just misses with a left hook there. Now connects with a right. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking. Oh! He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, big left hook there. Good punch. Lands a nice straight punch there. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. What do you follow up a great punch like this with? I'm excited to see what happens. They continue to exchange. Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. He engages in the single collar tie. Nice. Oh, and there's that head kick. He kept talking about the opening that would be there on Thursday. Those words proven prophetic right there. Oh, that was a big takedown. Is this the one that's going to break him? All right, working inside his opponent's guard here. You cannot sit in these jiu-jitsu guys' guard. And you can't have one arm in, one arm out. Guys will start throwing up legs, chasing triangles. Beautiful movement, hip work on the ground here, just outstanding with the transition. He is not staying in one place on the ground. That's very important. 20 seconds to go. Bottom fighter trying to control posture, unable to do so. And now he's in a lot of danger. He's got to grab that head or he's going to get blasted. All right, half guard position here, DC. You have an extra hop in your step when you talk about fighters working out of this half guard. Oh, man. I like half guard as a top fighter. I understand half guard as a bottom fighter. Don't want to be there. It's right. very dangerous. But if you are there, you have to be winning the position of the underhook. It opens up so many opportunities for you to either escape or sweep. Well, what a round it was, especially from a striking standpoint. DC, take us through High-level striking. I mean, this is what people come through the doors to see. Two men stand on a quarter, chest to chest, forehead to forehead, and let it all fly. I'm surprised nobody went out, but it does excite me for the next round. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Ooh, big shot land. <laughs> Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Just misses with that one. I mean, he's cut them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, blocks the shot. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Outstanding output on both sides. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Great punch landed with so much power. Oh, yeah, right hand. All right, single power tie now. Right hand punch from the clinch. Sneaky head kick. Straight right, he misses. 
nice connection with a punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Just over three minutes to go. Oh, he postured up there, gained some valuable separation. And now the grounded pound starts. Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hip escape. All right, side control now. We'll see if he can advance position. Man, look at the redness starting to appear on the left side of his body. His opponent would be wise to continue to attack there. Oh, really nice work to keep busy off of his back as he lands some more offense here from Bob. And they both stand up. That's a big strike right there. Nice, sneaky head kick. Oh, misses with the jab. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. There's no give on that leg kick. Oh, single collar tie here. If your opponent has you in the clinch, pull a huge elbow there. Fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape DC. Back to the feet. Big punch land. Ooh. Wow! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. We'll finish this fight. Defense. Nice kick. Yeah. Try to establish that jab. Left hook, yep. Lands flush with that right hand. Spinning back fist. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Ooh, what a punch. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, here comes the kick. That one blocked by short. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. That was snuck in. Nice strike. Joy gets touched by that kick to the body. Makes, oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Seconds to go. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by Choi. 20 minutes down, potentially five to go. All right, there's the end of the round. So it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of it. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands, his opponent's on wobbly legs. That is exactly what, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round. Straight right hand, no good. What a punt. <laughs> Trying to establish that jab once again. Over and over, he's landing a big body kick. Oh, tagged him with that right. Oh! Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. 
Those right punches there. Big punch lands through the middle. He misses with the right hand. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Sidekick, well placed. Nice straight right lands. Joy gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense. Oh! He's hurt. Serve him up. We'll get him. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Able to check the high kick. Hands high, hands high. Boom! Big jab. Under three minutes now to go in the fight. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. Nice punch land over the top. Nice right hand. All right, well, time is the enemy now, DC, and he's really running out of it if he's going to get his hand raised tonight. He's got to go forward. He's got to go Close guard. Back to the feet now. Oh, big left. He got him. Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night.